Millions of people across the nation stopped what they were doing to catch a glimpse of today's solar eclipse. All eyes looking toward the sky this afternoon to witness the sun's disappearing act. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Lauren Barnes. Mike Landis was on assignment in West Plains. Here in Springfield, we experienced 95% totality of the solar eclipse of the heartland. Students at Missouri State University gathered on the football field at Plaster Stadium to watch it all happen. Fox 49's Carissa Codell joins us live tonight out Outside the stadium after getting reaction from students today. Carissa. Yeah, Lauren, it was so much fun. I was actually a student at MSU back for the eclipse in 2017, and I did what most of the other students did is I grabbed a pair of glasses from the stadium and went and found somewhere on campus to sit and watch. And just like last time, you could just feel the excitement, even though it was just a partial eclipse. So excited on a scale of one to 10, definitely an 11 up. <laughs> I am excited for the moon pies, but this is also awesome. I just wanted to be like in an environment and a community with everybody and just kind of experience it as my last year here at university. I, I have a test soon, but I thought I'd just come out for like 20 minutes and see it. Hundreds of students gathered on the field at Plaster Stadium to watch the solar eclipse. It was really cool. I didn't know that we were going to have like the full stadium filled. Energy is high. I'm glad. I didn't expect this many people to be this excited, but it's cool. And my class got canceled, so. It's nice. It definitely feels like it's getting colder. Is it just me? Megan Craven's class was pushed back an hour for the eclipse. And I was here in 2017, so it's kind of just like a full circle, like seeing it again my last year, so it's exciting. There were tables set up so everyone could grab glasses and even some moon pies for the occasion. But it's just nice seeing like how many people are like interested in this as well. Missouri State had NASA live streaming on the big screen in the end zone and a clock over the stand so we could count down to near totality. It's just so fun and exciting. The last time this happened, I was like a freshman in high school and now I'm a junior. So it's kind of crazy. Next time I'll see it, I'll be in my 40s. I'll be old. I'm going to get blind. <laughs> Everyone in Springfield was invited to come out, even if they weren't a student. Are you excited? Yeah. yeah. It's got pretty dark and overall is a really cool experience. I loved it. Go Bears and go Eclipse. And if you still have your glasses, well, you won't need them for another 20 or so years. The next solar eclipse that's going to happen in the U.S. isn't until 2044. So I guess just keep them in a safe place until then. Reporting live in Springfield, I'm Carissa Codell, Fox 49 News.